April 26, 2023, Florham Park, New Jersey, USA, New York Jets General Manager Joe Douglas addresses the media during the introductory press conference for quarterback Aaron Rodgers, 8, not pictured, at Atlantic Health Jets Training Center. Mandatory credit, Tom Horrock USA Today Sports. The Miami Dolphins went into the 2024 draft with a docked pick in the third round and no selection in the fourth round either. But they badly needed an offensive weapon to bolster their running game, and all the talents were being taken off the shelves one by one. Thus, without anyone's surprise, they gave up a 2025 third for a pick for this year's fourth. Little did they know, this transaction indirectly helped the NY Jets GM, Joe Douglas make an impressive trade. During his recent appearance on the official Jets podcast, General Manager Joe Douglas dove deep into how the swap of picks materialized on the final day of the draft. He labeled the entire thing unique, as just a few minutes prior, the Eagles had given up their fourth round pick for next year's third. And he wondered if someone would offer his Jets a similar trade, even expressing the same sentiment to his draft room. To his surprise, just five minutes later, the Detroit Lions reached out to the Green Gang, asking for a similar trade. The club decided to give up their 126th overall pick, fourth round, in exchange for a third in 2025. That was unique because just a few minutes before, Miami had done a trade with Philadelphia, Douglas recounted. A few minutes passed, I look over to our draft room, and I was like, man, I wish someone would call and offer us something like that. And lo and behold, five minutes later, Detroit calls, and they made a similar offer. As per Paul Andrew Esden Jr. on X, the new and improved Jets currently boast two third-round and two sixth-round picks for next year's draft. Given the team's noteworthy additions during free agency, these moves were somewhat expected. The New York Jets who are currently in the longest playoff drought in the league, have left no stone unturned to bolster their roster. Or, at least, the offensive side of the ball. Out of their seven picks, the club went on to select five offensive weapons, including QB Jordan Travis in the fifth round. On top of that, they seem to have stumbled upon another quarterback prospect, Byron Peewee Jarrett, who has swayed both fans and pundits alike. He is among the 17 undrafted free agents who are set to appear in the team's mini-camp. Interestingly, Rich Chimini of ESPN has already thrown his weight behind the former UCF QB, who has tallied 65 touchdowns in the past two years. In a league so grand, it wouldn't be much of a surprise if Jarrett, nicknamed Pee Wee, can find a spot in the 53-man roster. It would sure be a big break for the star prospect who even contemplated hanging up his cleats and pursuing other opportunities due to a lack of interest from reputable colleges, as per Sports Illustrated.